Active Geelong is on a mission to make Geelong Australia's most active region. We're a collective impact organisation supported by dedicated researchers and experts, as well as community leaders, collaborating to support, coordinate and promote physical activity initiatives in the Geelong region. We aim to inspire and empower movement by working with others to help people get moving more. This project idea came about about two years ago when we were looking to get an Active Geelong event up and running. But as we worked through it, we realised that we can make a greater impact in our community by guiding event planners on how they can incorporate physical activity into their own events. I'm proud to have been the project champion for this project and I'm excited by the prospect of embedding healthy behaviours into events throughout Geelong. I'd like to thank our project team, Anna, Tim, Shane, James and Andre for their work in what has been an incredibly challenging year. Over to the team. Don't mind us, we're just getting active. But welcome to the Active Geelong Events Guide presentation. We're so pleased that you can join us today because we're so excited to be presenting to you about how we're going to help make Geelong Australia's most active region. Who wouldn't want to live in Australia's most active region? We certainly do, we know that you do too. We've already got the beaches, the sporting facilities, the parks and trails, and Australia's most successful active sporting team, the Geelong Cats, on our doorstep. So what else can we do? We thought, what an opportunity to help involve Geelong's workplaces in incorporating physical activity into their big events. Let's start by talking about Active Geelong, what they stand for. Active Geelong is a community of dedicated specialists that collaborate to inspire proactive enjoyment of life through easy access to physical activity for everybody, every day. Its aim is to make Geelong Australia's most active region. It's a collective collaborative movement on a mission to, one, make Geelong workplaces the most active in Australia by 2022. Two, make Geelong's GPs the most actively committed to, to, to promoting physical activity in Australia by 2022. Thirdly, to help ensure every person gets a minimum daily dose of physical activity every day by 2025. And last, to be recognised as a movement that embraces the whole community. So, today, we're going to talk you through how we're going to utilise an event guide that's going to help workplaces increase their activity during events, conferences and meetings, and help make their events and conferences more healthy. We're going to show you how to use the guide, what the benefits are, some consideration to help boost activity, and also going to get you up and active for a moment or two as well. We're going to talk to you about some key planning that you can do for events and how to utilise the Active Geelong Healthy Rating Checklist. Now I'm going to hand over to you to Tim, who's going to help talk you through the benefits of exercise. All right, incorporating physical activity into your event, whether this be a corporate or community-based event, can have multiple benefits. You don't have to run a marathon or swim endless laps in the pool in order to activate those all-important endorphins. While there are endless long-term benefits of exercise, this guide helps you focus on the short-term and items to make you feel better now with immediate feedback. Exercise can be a tool to bring together people of all backgrounds, abilities and fitness levels, ensuring that your event is both engaging and inclusive. So why incorporate physical activity? A Stanford paper showed that just 10 minutes of stationary exercise can result in up to 20% improvement in memory tasks. Moderate aerobic exercise has been proven to improve reaction and problem solving capabilities. The perfect supplement to any team event. The all important activity of converting calories into energy, using exercise to fight off that post lunchtime fatigue. We've all experienced that lethargic feeling after a big lunch. Be sure to set up your event for success and adapt an active style with the help of the Active Geelong Events Guide. Now let's all get active with Anna. So what I want to do now is quickly demonstrate how you can incorporate some activities into your next event. So what I want everybody to do today is to stand up and just start walking on the spot. Let's get moving. So what we'd recommend is that you would do five to 10 minutes of a light walk, either inside the venue or outside the venue during your event. Now what we're going to do is run through some exercises that you could incorporate into your next event. So what I'll do is put some slides up on the screen and we'll just run through, just mindful of time, we'll just do a few squats, hip extensions and heel raises. So standing with your feet slightly wider than hip width and feet angled outwards, slowly drop your hips down 
ensuring your knees are in line with your toes. And then squeeze those muscles to stand back up. So let's just run through five of those. Next, we'll move on to some hip extensions. So keeping your knees straight and holding onto a chair if you need to, extend your leg behind you and squeezing those bottom muscles and returning your leg to the starting position. Just do five on each leg. And then lucky last, we'll do some heel raises. Again, balance on a chair or a bench. Lift your heels off the floor and hold and pause for three seconds and then lower back down. So we'll just do five of those. So you can see how easy it is to incorporate some exercises into your event. Now I'm going to hand ball back to Andre who can talk to you more. Ah, food and drinks. The choice of food and beverage will have a big impact on the mood, energy and level and concentration of your event. Provide small meals more frequently, light, fresh and healthy. Offer people to stand up during their lunch. Encourage people to stand up and get their water bottle. Planning your event. is important to plan your event. Prepare the way you're going to build physical activities during, before and after the events. Incorporate movement and stretching. Add some extra time during morning, afternoon and lunch breaks and encourage people to stand up. Email your participants about where to park your car or bicycle to encourage them to walk to the venue. My tips to you, take the stairs, probably not right way, take the stairs instead of the lift, incorporate exercise component on the day. There are lots of physical activity you can book in the Geelong region. James, could you tell us about the checklist? Thanks, Andre. So we've heard about how you can use the Active Events Guide to make your event active. So I'm going to talk about how you can now gain endorsement for your event through Active Geelong. So at the back of the Events Guide, we've incorporated a 10-item checklist, which covers off the topics raised in the guide. So for example, have you advised attendees it's okay to stand during a presentation? Have you allowed space for exercise during movement breaks? Have you scheduled appropriate movement breaks or standing breaks to allow for stretching and movement? And two is the recommended number for an all-day event. Have you advised of lunchtime walking options and allow time in the schedule? So using the checklist. So if you can check off up to three items, then your event isn't particularly active. And we'd ask if there are any opportunities you could identify to make your event more active. If you can check off between four and six items, then your event's well on the way to being considered active. And we'd ask that you just have a look and see if there's anything you could change or modify to lift your event up where it could be endorsed as active. If you score between seven and 10, then your event is considered an active event. So at this point, we'd ask that you email Active Geelong, who will then be able to endorse your event. You'll then be able to promote your event as an Active Geelong endorsed active event. So back to you. Anna. On behalf of Committee for Geelong, Active Geelong and my project group, Shane, Tim, Andre and James, we thank you for your participation today. We ask you to leave with the commitment to make Geelong the most active region and incorporate an active component into your next event. You can find more information and the guide on the Active Geelong website and sign up to become a movement champion. Thank you. Um, we'll now handball back to Roxy.